Fuck your time trials. Just like your chicken strips. What do you get against chicken strips? Fuck your chicken strips. It had been a while since I'd been back in the U.S. Next up, the notorious mugshot. Ruthless muscle of the fiendish thigh. What he lacked in brains, he definitely made up for in brawn. Turns out he wasn't always that way. He grew up as the run of the litter. <laughs> the neighborhood weakling. The only friends he could turn to were usually found on the big screen. It was there that he spotted his first gangster, and he knew instantly that that's what he wanted to be. He spent the rest of his youth working really voice. hard to get there, fueled on his dreams of great power and respect. With enough perspiration, he realized that dream. He There's a lot of hard oil notice about sweet brawl, tough as nails gangster, ensuring that he never be kicked on or pushed around again. So he's holed up in Mesa City, huh? I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. Sunset Snake Eyes. Oh shit. <laughs> I don't know that would actually do something. Yep. <laughs> Is there a way to skip the... It won't... It won't make you do the okay, cutscene again. Fuck your sign and your rules. Something's happened. Where is everyone? I don't know, but it's starting to give me the creeps. What do you say we take off? And miss all the fun? Besides, I want to try out that new move I got from Raleigh's section of the Thievius Raccoonus. You mean the Ninja Spire Jump? Yeah. Do me a favor and read me the instructions again. To land safely upon diminutive points, leapeth lively and presseth the triggering device with the round geometrical object emblazoned upon it. So jump and hit the circle button to land on narrow spots. That's a rough translation. I don't think the ancient Japanese spoke like that. <laughs> wow, that's how you do it. Yeah, really useful. Thought it was gonna be like a fucking like hand spring or some shit. No, for the most part it just involves him landing on things. Drop attack! Bitch. <laughs> Bitch. Ha! Ah, ha! Ah. <laughs> Get the fuck out of that. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, 40? Yeah. Don't worry, I know where they are. Really? <laughs> bow, bow, bow. Yeah, it's a really catchy... Dog? Yeah. Literally the dog from Tom and Jerry. Literally. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just straight up. Okay, don't go jumping on that mattress, because you gotta go around the water circuit. 
around the water. Instead of around the water, instead of around the water, not in it. Oh god. Very small window to uh, to correct yourself. Well, you very small. Use the. Yeah, I was, I was using slow, and it still happened. You bounce on the mattress. Now you bounce on the mattress. Had a very good reaction there. <laughs> What's with those flashing lights? The latest in high tech Years security. of practice. Electronic floor sensors. Step on them and you're a goner. Nice touch. They're safe to walk on while flashing, but it also means they're about to switch to a different sector. Okay, so, that, uh, light post that you're next to, uh -huh. you gotta get up that. in this level are just straight up like every cartoon dog ripoff ever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they look like a little plug of fucking Looney Tunes dog. Oh, wait till you see the Dalmatian. <laughs> is, is it... Wait, is it just a Dalmatian version of Goofy or is it just straight up Pongo? Uh, neither. As far as I know, neither of them have a gambling addiction. 
Ninja card throwing Dalmatian. Yep. Everything's wibble wobbly in this in this level. Now behind that car is a clue that's hidden. It was a bitch to find. What car? That one. Oh, uh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, fuck off. <laughs> yeah. That's some bullshit. It is. Especially because how the fuck do you get out? You had to jump up onto the leather seat. Very carefully, I assume. Yeah. Did it somehow. That was indeed a burp. Just enough. Thankfully there's one like right here. Yep. Oh! God damn it! Yeah, you gotta be careful. Oh shit, shoot. And go back. I miss him. Yeah. The bone oh, house. Green's pipe. There's a pipe somewhere. Right above you. Not that one. Ah. You have to climb up that pipe. experiencing a latency, so I'm going to try and fix that real quick. Okay. The bone house means something else completely entirely out of context. <laughs> yes, it does. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty good. Safe to walk on them when they're flashing. Hello, Dimension Man. Got to backtrack to uh, where we had that pipe confusion. Okay. That 
goes back this way, wouldn't it? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead and get that lucky charm, and then climb up the rope that's over it. I think these power lines were down. Enter the vault code. Yeah. A little bit of higher mathematics and voila! Dial in 314. <laughs> Outstanding! You've uncovered Rob the Cooper's patented explosive hat technique. Use the triangle button to toss your cap. Then use the triangle button again to detonate it. Better back off to a safe distance first. Excuse me? You can plant mines now. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, and, he, and he means it when he says back off, because if you're close, it will hurt you. Big as the explosion. Not as big as you'd think, but still big enough. I heard it. Yeah. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, I'm thinking that's like that's something weird wrong way. with the emulation. Get the key. Key has gotten. On to the hub world. Yay. Mug castle. It's <laughs> <sighs> a powerful sneeze. <laughs> well, this mug shot certainly isn't shy. Okay, so we know he's here somewhere, but how are we supposed to find him? Mesa City is a big place! Given that he's a bulldog, it seems only reasonable to assume that he choose to live in a giant fire hydrant. <laughs> That's some sound logic, Sly. Now you just need to find a way to break into the building's base. Oh, I'm sure I'll think of something. <laughs> what the fuck? That fucking dog's walk. Laughing. That fucking dog's walk cycle. Yeah. He's got him some groove going. He must be listening to some tunes. <laughs> Unfortunately, those tunes have now been silenced. It's the boss. I love Mugshot's voice. <laughs> So, 
Uh, there's nowhere to really farm for lives here. Mm -hmm. So you're pretty much just stuck with gathering coins. Alright. Um, you are presented with two minigame areas and a standard level. Do you know which one is the standard level? I do. Uh, you want to go to Boneyard Casino for standard level. Okay. Am I near that, or do I gotta go another way? Uh, go back through the bus. Or train, whatever. Subway car. Yeah. And make your way to the right. That's it. Okay. You're not gonna be able to pull that off. Just wanted to see. It doesn't look impressive, but it is still like a one-shot KO. Oh wow. Well. What? Oh. Uh, that's towards one of the mini games. <laughs> yeah. I just want to see what was up here. Trash can. You gotta shut the lights off. Who turned out the lights in there? Nice job getting in, but look out for those guards. Mugshot's got those machine gun toting dogs hunting like a pack. I mean, yeah. Huh. Yeah, well. don't get noticed. <laughs> You can hop on those areas with the plants. And you can jump on the uh, one armed bandits behind them. You can take him out. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> you missed. Uh, what the hell?
Não. If you take down the cards, alcohol bottles, and poker chips, you get money out of those too. Drop attacking these guys. Uh, now, sound does not um, alert these guys. It's the only thing that really alerts them is getting in their line of sight or when one of them blows a whistle okay. so if you get on that uh, if you get on that bone I'm pretty sure you're able to um... dive no drop a mine on them Isn't the bone a uh, sneak thing and it's moving? Uh, try it where you are right now. Oh. in the new prohibition. Holy Jesus. There's some wibbly ass fucking chandeliers. Yeah. He looks like a prime candidate for a drop attack. Yep. the spinning uh, slot game. We have to ha catch the hook. So climb the rope on the chandelier. Sweet. You'll be 
be going out of business soon if I keep doing this, sir. Also, the casino's flooded. You might want to fix that. Yeah. I mean, nothing's up to code in here. It's ridiculous. I recommend not dealing with these until you've made it up to the end. Okay. Now keep in mind, you can walk on the goddamn. It's flashing. Forgetting I have a horse, I had a horseshoe, so I fucking think I'm dead every time. Uh, you can break his legs. What? There's sharks on the roulette wheels. Or shark heads. I, I I don't think so. I think those are cameras. No. fucking dudes and machine guns on it. No. Nah. Missing anything in here considering the cameras like this? No, not really. There's one more right at the very end. Oh. <laughs> I was about to say. I know. I, I get that far and I'm like, I feel like I'm missing something. <laughs> Press the circle to enter the vault code. Man, I'm getting swift with deciphering these codes. Dial 338. from 
found your hyperactive ancestor, B.F. Cooper. He discovered a way to speed up the clock. Perfect for those long stakeouts. Just hold down the triangle button to use it. I had a fucking ancestor that could use the speed force. <laughs> oh, it, it, it gets crazier. Okay, so what is that used for? Oh, well, I see you in a minute. I personally never use it for anything. Okay, try to land in the green spot, spot if you can. wheel is spinning too fast to jump counterclockwise around it. You'll have to jump in the other direction to try to land on the green section. <laughs> it is annoying, yeah. Thankfully, it seems like I. Oh, wait, no. I, there's probably a thing where it's like, oh, you need all the keys. Oh. Well, in order to get to the boss fight, you need all the keys, so. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. so. Minigame sections, um, I guess. Yeah. There are two. There, there are two different kinds here. one you're approaching is a uh, turret section. And the other one? A race. We have turret section first. Basically, Murray's gonna be going and running for a key, and you have to cover him with a turret. Okay, so what do I do? Provide some covering fire for him with that blasting station. Sweet. Use the left analog stick it's a to turret, aim you and press the square button to fire. I'll do my best. Blasting station. Hey. Time to move, Sly. <laughs> oh God. Bird controls why? Zoom in. No. I have no oh. idea. I could not oh. tell you why. <laughs> Alright. Oh, this one counts for lives. Fuck you, man. Yep. Let's go, Sly. Yeah. 
I know for a fact that race doesn't. Yeah, just don't shoot the radioactive barrels. At least not while he's near them anyway. No, don't. Just at all. That's a bad idea. Am I shooting giant boxing gloves? I don't... I never saw that. I thought they were rockets. Just turret controls with the in the pause menu. Oh, what the fuck! God damn it! Is that better? Not much, but hopefully I won't make as many mistakes. It's still floaty as a bitch. Oh yeah, absolutely. And now I've been trained that it's the opposite because of that one instance, so now I'm doing that. God. Murder controls suck ass. They do, I hate them. I why hate did, them. Why do they exist? No, 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 no. to God, it's not as bullshit, if not more. Really? Really? A button? Really? Really? Oops. 
starting to think there's some glitches with the fucking emulator. <laughs> It would explain all the issues you've been having. Eat shit. <laughs> Can I break this? At the it dog really track. Yeah, it looks breakable. It looks like it stands out. Hurry. What's going on down there? Well, I drove to this hot dog stand for a quick snack, and the next thing that you know, I'm getting challenged face, to a race by these gangster it does. dogs. It's one of the uh, developers. The yeah, <laughs> three times around the track for a key. It's all you, man. Drive the van with the left analog stick, and if you manage to pick up any nitro power-ups, you can get a boost by pressing the square button. Go get them. I'm on it. Square baton. Mario Kart. No, it's not. It's way more infuriating. I'm wondering why these guys decided to challenge a guy in a van. <laughs> They have the prize. Everything in this game is play aggressive, so you really gotta go in, ram, ram the crap out of these guys, fight them for any place you can take. Bang them. That'll teach them a lesson. Bang them. Bang them with your humongous hippo cock. I don't think we're talking about the same thing anymore, Sly. Trust me, it's what the internet wants to see. <laughs> What's the internet? That sounds like Bailey's thing. It is, and I completely agree. Billy would want me to bang these guys. Yeah. This is 
How I, this level was how I figured out that my grandma couldn't play racing games. <laughs> I was asking her to help me with it. other race in the game. How far away is it? Is it in the same level or is it like later? Late game. Late game. Okay, thank you. But honestly, the racing game is the most unbearable part for me. <laughs> I, I see why now. <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> Good I, news, uh... it's only in this game. Thank Jesus. <laughs> Flip. All right. Then. Someone might someone might want to turn their car off before their battery dies. Yeah. Or something. Hello, you big bitch. Multiple keys. There was supposed to be a cutscene that went off. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like he pulls up the Binocucom and has to talk to Bentley. Uh, go up to the go up to the face. Maybe it's there. Up to the face. There it is. Would you look at that ugly mug? I am, and I find it infinitely fascinating. Huh? My X-ray detection devices reveal Gay. that a secret elevator to Mugshot's penthouse is contained within that giant head. So how do we get in? Behind this locked wall, there's a lever that summons the elevator. But you need all seven keys to open it up. I'm on it. 
Hunga 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 bunga. Are the rest of these levels regular? Uh, yes. There's one that has an interesting gimmick in it, but... All of them are just standard sly levels. That's good. Okay, this one is one that you might have to come back to because right. it has a segment in it where you have expendable uh, bounce areas and there are clues attached to those expendable bounce areas. So you have to hit them on the first go. Yeah, go by way of the bouncing, uh... Canopies? Yeah. And then you're gonna come right back down once you've hit the end. Down.
part I was talking about. Oh boy. Did I miss anything over there, or no? You did miss one clue early on, but you can't, you couldn't go back for it. No. Oh, there's no bottom. Okay, cool. Yeah. Am I back where I can get it now, or? Uh, no, you couldn't. You only had one shot at it. Oh, the, the one with the other jump thing? Yeah. Been to Mesa City, but this game makes it look like a shithole. <laughs> I'm sure there, I'm sure there's one city that I took inspiration from, like Detroit. Probably. God, camera. we need to get when we come back. Back out.
There we go. There it is. All you gotta do is make it well. Make your way downtown with your bitch. She's gonna make you a sandwich. <laughs> da 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 da. <laughs> Making your way downtown with your bitch. She's gonna make you a sandwich. Da 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 da. I still think that guy's a genius, whoever came up with that. Shite. <laughs> Fucking fat thumbed it. So, it's on the stream. Press the circle to enter the vault code. I could have broken this code in my sleep. The combination is 565. Five. Kind of look like you already are, honestly. Honest, I don't think I ever uh, capitalized on that in the last. <laughs> yeah, it's because I'm here. There's nothing in there. Straight to the tip of tip of top top. Yeah. Okay, here's where that sound effect is that I was telling you about. God! <laughs> Talk about okay. Rosie. Oh, fucking Rosie. Now, before you do anything, before you do, um, listen, listen, listen. Whenever you jump on a car and it finally lands on the ground, that sound effect.
<laughs> Every time. <laughs> I know they look like you can't climb on them, but with your thieving skills, I bet you can pull it off. So every so every time you jump on that car, you send it careening to the ground. You're killing you're killing someone. Every time you jump on a car, there's <laughs> more than one. A car. Okay. Make sure you take your time exploring, cause fuck your coins. Ventilations. Your air doesn't need to be ventilated. You're not important. Smell that wet dog and fucking ass all day. Yo! Didn't even see you, fuckhead. So have you have you taken the time to appreciate and notice that how how well Sly moves around and plays, just how fitting it seems to play he plays as? Yeah, he's pretty good at control. You aren't gonna believe me, but they improve upon that <laughs> in the other games. It gets better. Yeah. I need those coins. Wouldn't these, wouldn't these poles be hot as fuck to the touch? I mean, I've never actually, you know, touched a neon light while it was on, but it's still a light, so I would assume it gets heat, it heats up. Oh! I'm back. Did I miss one? No, no, you're good. Uh, oh, you dropped again? I just got kicked. Oh. Uh, feel free to jump off where you are, because you can. There's a bunch of stuff you can get. It's like oddly satisfying knowing that you just dropped a car on someone's head. I would better kill someone while they were in it. Why the fuck were they in it? I don't know, man. You, you can never trust anything with these gangsters. I'm, ass I'm assuming they have their reasons, as no matter how screwed up they may be. You're not, you're not done. I'm going for the coins. I 
many do I have? 28. Uh. Another thing that I really like about this game is the fact that it's really intuitive because you always know what you can jump to. Yeah. You know exactly how far you can go. Alongside you, but I, uh, I, I had uh, practice tonight, and I was, and I was exhausted afterwards. Right. At least there, I don't have to deal with puns, though. I got a voiceover message for the two minute thing who's making off with all my treasure keys. You did, Kali. If I get my hands on you, I'm gonna fit you with your own. <laughs> I love mugshot. <laughs> so fucking jike. You can tell he's a Jersey kid. Yeah. Ow, my ass. Quit involving your ass in fighting. Biggest asset. Was that intentional? No, it was not, I swear. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> like, I have to be wary, man. I have to be on the lookout, and I hate that. <laughs> Press the circle to enter it, it, it just brings you happiness to listen to. <laughs> you need an IQ of at least 140 to figure this one out. Dial in 468. It's like that's like part of like a common number sequence. Okay. Again, it's the method in which he's doing it, but still. It's a three digit code. <laughs> it can only be so many things. Oh, yeah, this will come in handy. It's Suzanne Cooper's notes pertaining to water safety. <sighs> oh, With this thank knowledge under God. Your mouth, you won't have to waste a charm whenever you fall into water. Thank holy this Jesus. Is why, <laughs> this is why I'm having you get these vaults. <laughs> Aren't you happy that I'm having you go for the clues? Yes. End of so the you train. gotta. Yep. Oh, it's literally just a loop. Oh no. Ah. 
That's what we did. One more level and a boss fight, and then we'll, we'll be done. Yeah, it sounds good. Oh, I'm buffering major right now. Things were going so well, too. <laughs> now, I will tell you this. This boss fight is the one I had the most trouble with. But... It's fairly straightforward. Now, I will tell you this, with this level, in spite of everything that's going on, make sure to explore as much as you can. Okay. Yuck, these rooftops are filthy! Because there will be pressure put on you to rush. Fucking Twitch, stop buffering! <laughs> need to be able to see to help. Okay. Yeah, six clues now. Buffering. Perfect. I'm starting to think that, uh... Well, well, oh, well, shit. look who just walked into my crosshairs, Sly Cooper. About time you showed up, Miss Fox. I was getting worried about you. Suffering but again. You wrong turn somewhere back in Paris. The only one making wrong turns is you, Sly. I'd suggest you surrender before I paralyze you with my good friend, the shock pistol. Now see, a girl whose best friend's a firearm's got issues. A little dinner, a little dancing. I think I can help you out. Hmm, sounds romantic. As long as you don't mind dining in jail. Nah, I hear the service is lousy. Once I catch you, you'll know for yourself. The good thing your shot is to fire slow as the bus. Yeah. So make sure you look around and get all the things you can. Oh yeah. And a lot of people noticed how slow Carmelita's uh, shot pistol was in these games. Or in this game. So, in every game afterwards, her shot pistol gets stupidly faster. <laughs> The fucking... Like, right now she's firing, like, three... She, she fires once every three or four seconds. Right. Later. In the second game, she's firing, like, once every... Once every two seconds. At the slowest. In the third game, she fires three to four times per second. A machine gun. <laughs> it's the same pistol. <laughs> it's like the blaster pistol in all the Star Wars games. Hold on, no! I hope we got all of them. I hope we did. Good night, I am so far behind. Jeez, stupid buffer. What the hell? 
should have let you grab that. Why did you do that? I think we're gonna have to come back. I might be wrong. I'll go back outside for just a second. Uh, turn uh, left. I thought I saw something dancing back there. Never mind. during the initial chase on one of those rooftops. We'll have to come back. Alright. But this is like one of my favorite levels in the in the game. Yo! Bitch! The Dalmatian looks diseased. It's probably because it's, it's probably because the spots are shit they put on. It looks like it's fucking diseased. Chandeliers. At the tail end of this, why is there so much buffering? <laughs> I'm gonna try something. didn't do much, but hopefully it did something. Okay, so I'm caught up, hopefully. Yeah, I'm caught up. That's what these things are for.
トートタングルあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっはい、私の場合は、私の場合は、Hey, as long as, as long as no one's physically getting hurt, I don't really care. I mean, as long as it's consensual, I don't, I don't have any issues, but it's like, it, it, it's one of those things where it's like confusing to me, because it's like, I would absolutely never allow somebody to do that to me. Check, 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 what? Check, the uh, check every corner. Fucking A button. God damn it. Stop being the asshole, please. I'm not seeing it. Corner of every rooftop. That's what you guys do. Oh, I see it. Right at the end, too. Yep. Hold on, hold on, wait, 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 go back. Wait, what, you... what, what are you talking about? You went past the, you went past the vault. Oh shit, yeah. Get the level of a rush. <laughs> yeah. Sticking to it, I don't care. <laughs> Do you have trouble with that button with um, other games? No. Well, if I use it for a long enough period of time, yeah.
Okay. Remember to get you the vault this time. be nerd. Wait, I just realized that might be an Indians uh -huh. in a casino joke. It's Sir Andrew Cooper's thief <laughs> replica is. technique. He used to make fake stand-ups of himself to confuse guards into attacking the wrong thing. Use the triangle button to put together a fake Sly Cooper. Decoy. I don't use it in Halo. I don't use it in Halo Reach, so I'm probably not going to use it here. Well, it's a good way to draw fire off of you for a little while. So if I click the exit level button, will this count? Yeah. Okay. You can check it in the in the map too. select button. Ah, okay. Onward, I guess. Yep. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Lever. Would you look at that ugly mug? I am. Let's do this, hot dog. Last call. <laughs> what? My boys have been yapping about some big mysterious dude running around cracking skulls and dude. <laughs> and and this is it? You're the monkey wrench in my operation? Some scrawny rat with a stick. Look at this right. dude. Wait a second. I seen that stick before. Maybe when my father knocked your block off with it. Your father? Wow. You'll get a good look at it when I shove it up your ass. You know, that thing is Rakamagookas <laughs> had a lot of nice pictures, but way too many big boys. So you don't mind just handing it over? Why? <laughs> what, are you kidding? You break into my place, steal my stuff, trash the joints, I feel transgressed and violated. Let's rock! Oh, God. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, no direct contact, no direct physical violence, because it's not going to work. Be ready to jump whenever he pulls those guns out. And you want to spin the mirrors around to light up the person. Why don't you try hitting some of those mirrors? That may redirect the sunlight to your advantage. I got a spare 
Hold on, say something for me real quick. Uh, this, this is bullshit. Okay. I heard you talking over my microphone. What's going on? I heard you talking over my microphone, but not on the stream for a second. I guess I just didn't hear it. I was on me. I thought that you had done that intentionally. Holy fuck, no I did not. It ain't right. <laughs> you want all of that stupid picture book? You're gonna have to go down to Haiti and cross paths with Miss Ruby. You're gonna have to go down to insert location to fight insert name. Mugshot section of the Thievius Raccoonus contain an entry from my gunslinging ancestor, Tennessee Kid Cooper. His specialty was the rail walk and rail slide. Moves perfected through a lifetime of theft in the old west. This is where we get into the sliding. Getting out of town yep. proved to be a little more challenging than getting in. Having just missed us, Inspector Fox went for the next best thing and dragged that canine steroid case off to jail. Just missed us my ass. That was the end of Mugshot's gambling empire, and Mesa City's citizens soon returned home. While me and the boys, well, we enjoyed the rest of our stay in America, and then returned to Paris, ready for our next mission. Still fucking done, not star. What the fuck? I figured yep. out a way to get us to Haiti. What you got going on, Murray? Hey, you're playing a game too. What is it? Though? Better not be Fortnite. I will <laughs> kill a motherfucker over that. What is it? The fucking. And it, it's, oh, it's a PlayStation. I see the controller. You must be playing the original. You must be playing uh, Crash Bandicoot because I can hear the ooh in the background. That's Which him. I am. <laughs> um, he's playing a mini game from later on in the game. Is that why he's like, oh shit, oh oh, oh god. <laughs> Okay, well, that's what, two levels down? Yep. I figured out a way to get us to Haiti. Okay, we'll, uh, we'll leave it there for tonight. Alright, cool. How many levels does it have, do you know? Uh, five. Five? Okay. Yeah. And the the last one's pretty short. <laughs> because there's no hub world in it. Okay, it's just a straight shot. Yeah, it's linear. Okay, well, we might be able to finish this next time. Make myself big again. Save that game. Okay. Well, that was, uh, 
like the first half of Sly Cooper? Yeah, we we finished up forty percent of it according to the completion. Ooh. I know it. Do, I know it doesn't sound like it, but I am having fun. <laughs> well, that's good. I'm honestly surprised it took me this long to get to the game. <laughs> at least it's not. Uh, at least it's not Code Vein. <laughs> Fight him twice, Scrub. <laughs> <laughs> That's still one of yeah, my that most. Was some bullshit. That's st that's still one of my most popular videos, to be completely honest. <laughs> that was bullshit. I am sorry. I am not going to be able to think up a part of middle finger tonight. Okay. Well, I was having to remain remain very objective with what we were doing. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna. I don't know. You want to say good night to everyone, Smokey? Yeah, she's saying no. Mm -hmm. You don't like belly rubs, that's new. That's the weird. <laughs> well, I mean... She is an outside cat, and she's fended for herself for a little bit before she found us, so... True. <laughs> so what you up to right now? Eh, I'm looking for, looking for a song to, uh, take us out. All right. I'm just excited for when we get to the second one, because that's when the game really starts to become its own thing. Right. Okay, well, while I look for while I look for something, uh, thank you all for coming out. Thank you to all the people who showed up. Even if you showed up for five seconds, you gave me a view. Still appreciate it. And thank you to thank you to Dyer and Dingus for being here as long as you were and helping me through this. That sounded like it was about to go into some really hard techno. <laughs> it was about to do something. <laughs> OK. 
Okay, this is the instrumental version, so hopefully that one won't be copywritten. <laughs> Okay. Well, uh, first, first before I play the before I play the outro, I'm gonna play one. I'm gonna play something that hopefully I can get started as a as a thing. All right. So with that, good night, everybody. See you next time. Night, everybody. Later. Ha, ha, ha.